When I was eight years old, I didn't have any friends. My mom wouldn't allow me to play outside with the other kids in our neighborhood. I was always alone. The only playmates I had were my cousins and my brother, but it took three hours and 25 minutes to get to their houses. One day, my mom let me play outside with the kids in our neighborhood for the first time because she was going somewhere, maybe to work or to run errands. I got my dolls and other toys and was excited to play with the kids outside. When I got there, no one wanted to play with me. The attempt was useless, but then someone approached me. He had puppy eyes and was cute. We quickly became playmates. Even though he was a boy, he would join me for tea parties with my dolls. He also invited me to play with him at his house. But I was confused because his house looked old and abandoned. Like it hadn't been cleaned up for almost 12 years. We decided to go play in his garden. When we got there, I puked. I didn't know why at the time, but for some reason, I was disgusted. He didn't offer me water or anything. He just looked at me grinning and said, next time you're going to sleep here too. Two weeks after that upsetting experience, I went looking for him. A paper airplane flew to me out of nowhere. I picked it up and when I opened it, I was shocked, scared, and sad. It was a newspaper clipping. The boy that I played with went missing nine years ago. I ran to my bedroom and I saw a shadow through my window. I looked at it closely and it was the boy. He was smiling. Today, I'm 19 years old and I still remember that part of my childhood so clearly.